Hey there friends, thanks for checking in and welcome to another video of my series called One Handgun, One Shotgun, and One Rifle. The handgun that I'm featuring today is a Grand Power X Caliber with a 5 inch bull barrel that is fluted and the barrel rotates when firing, making it extremely smooth. Magazines hold 15 rounds. This is a race gun. It's extremely accurate. Double action, single action. The single action pull is right around three and a half pounds. Extremely light single action. Does have an ambidextrous thumb safety, fiber optic front sight, uh, a beautiful shooting gun. You can see it does have the cutouts in the slide. And I, I've loved this gun. I've loved it uh, since I've had it. About four years now. Excellent all around shooter. I got about 10 rounds loaded up. Let's see how it does. The rear sight, which is adjustable, is blacked out. So that, that red fiber optic front sight just pops out. And there it is. Love the Grand Power Excalibur. I find it to be a phenomenal shooting handgun. For a full-size gun, it's very accurate. Now let's get to that shotgun. The shotgun that I'm featuring today is not exactly a shotgun. It's a 12-gauge firearm, and here we have the Mossberg Shockwave with a 14.3-inch barrel. It does have a beaded front sight there. Corn cob polymer forend with a strap that definitely helps. Raptor grip right here. Five shells of two and three-quarter inch in the tube, one in the chamber. And then it does have the thumb safety right here. Total of six shells, 12 gauge. Let's see how it does. We'll take that thumb safety off, and here we go. That one was a little bit high. It dropped it down a little bit. There we go. Bam. And that should do it. Yep. Mossberg Shockwave, performing well at the range. Now let's get to that rifle. The rifle that I'm featuring today is my Yugo M70 AB2. AK-47 variant right here. The AB2 is the underfolder. It's got a button right there, folds under, straighten this part out, and it locks into place. It'll actually underfold a 30 round magazine. Then you hit the button again, to get it back into a full stock position. Polymer forend, all right, does have a grenade launcher right there, 16.3 inch barrel. It has an Elfman trigger, all right, so we'll go ahead and show clear here. Elfman trigger, just a very short trigger pull, and here's what you're looking at for the reset. It's like nothing. Now, they don't make those for AKs anymore. I asked them why, and they said because uh, it works, their trigger works on 99% of them, but it's that 1% that gives them a problem. People have to do just a little bit of, of filing down, and they don't want to do that. So that's why you don't see many Elfman triggers in the AKs. But here it is, M70 AB2. Pretty nice shooter. Let's go ahead and take some shots. I got a black target down there. I don't know if the, the camera will pick that up, but I was tagging it early. Missed. There we go. This is a one, shall I say, this is one nice shooting rifle. Kind of rushing the shots a little bit. Let me slow down and uh, hit. And that triggers like nothing. Thanks for watching another video in my series called One Handgun, One Shotgun, and One Rifle. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate thumbs up button. Thanks for watching, and you guys be safe.